Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. Hannah Lynn came out with a new book. It is called Early Works Grayscale Collection. So I'm assuming with that title, these are pictures that she's done a while ago. So here's the front cover, the back cover, and as she's been doing in her past few books, she does have two different versions of each page. One has the darker line art, a little bit easier to color for those of us who are not real good, <laughs> and then a lighter version of each picture. So here we have some samples from inside the book. I just love her pictures and her diamond paintings. I have a lot of Hannah's diamond paintings too. I just love her big eyed girls. So we have our title page. Has a note from the artist. These were created by hand using traditional materials such as watercolor pencils, ink, colored pencils, and acrylic paints by me, the artist Hannah Lynn. They were created in full color over many years, going as far back as 2008. The artworks were then digitally edited to offer a grayscale coloring experience. If you are unfamiliar with grayscale coloring, YouTube is a great resource for tutorials. Then she goes on to talk about herself. She does have a Patreon. And then she her books are available on Amazon. And then PDFs are also available on hannahlynn.com. In the front of the book, she always gives you images of all the pictures in this book. So if you look through and it's like, oh, I want to color that one, you can... Uh, look it up you can see instantly so here we go with the first one and oh my gosh I have this one in a diamond painting <laughs> it is so cute it's all rainbow colors oh it's just adorable I'll have to look at uh, that diamond painting maybe color it in like that so again this one's a little bit easier to color it has the real thick line art and then we have the more gray uh, version, a light version. Here is the black version. I guess I'll call it black and gray. <laughs> oh, her girls are just so cute. So again, the gray version is more difficult to color. But if you're, you know, more experienced with grayscale, um... Those turn out nice because you don't see the lines quite as much. The Nutcracker. I have that one too. <laughs> so yeah, I have some of these in diamond paintings. I have that one too. <laughs> A lot of these are in diamond paintings from Diamond Art Club. She has a lot of diamond paintings out with different companies. Oh, isn't she cute? So yeah, these are definitely older images. Oh, is that adorable? Oh my gosh, that is so cute. The hair is always so pretty in her pictures too. And you know, you can just straight color these images. Oh my gosh. Crazy Cat Lady. I have that one too. This is a huge diamond painting. But it's so adorable. Very detailed. That is a um, harder diamond painting, harder picture to color. 
lot of confetti in that diamond painting. Oh, that would make a great Halloween picture. Not sure if that's a diamond painting or not. Kind of looks like a Alice in Wonderland one. Just show your kit. Oh, that's cute. A little dinosaur. Oh, little monkeys. Well, kind of monkeys. Monkey snakes. <laughs> Oh, Red Riding Hood. I have that diamond painting, too. <laughs> like I said, I have a lot of Hamlin diamond paintings. I have to color more out of her books. Oh, that's pretty. In the background, you could just use pastels. Oh, Rapunzel. That one I didn't buy yet, but Diamond Art Club does have that one, too. Oh. I love some of the dresses she puts her girls in. Right now I'm working on Off to the Ball. Um, and oh, it's from Cinderella. So her carriage is in there and her gown is just gorgeous. with a unicorn. That would make a cute diamond painting. Oh, we even have a kitty down here. Here it is, off to the ball. So like I said, we have the carriage in the back and this dress is all in blues. Oh, I'm only down to about here. <laughs> but yeah, oh, I just love that dress. <laughs> Butterflies that hold them up. I believe this is another one they might have out. Not sure. I think that is one, the steampunk one. Don't have that one either. I don't have all of them. <laughs> I know, surprise, surprise. That one is, I love this one. And I do have this in a diamond painting. Mother Earth, it's called. That is so cool. Love it. All right. And that is it. Isn't that adorable? All right, so there are 20 images in here, and it is Amazon paper, right? Let's look in the back. 
Yes, it is Amazon paper. If you never are sure, look on the back page and you will see this with a date. And that is the date um, that they printed this. So they don't have these pre-printed. When you order one of these books, they print it up. So that's what the date is for. So this one says March 20th, 2022. March 26th, sorry. <laughs> All right, so as usual, I will leave a link to this book down below in the description if you would like to look at it yourself. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the flip through. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I hope everybody's having a terrific day. And as always, happy coloring. Bye, guys.